Hi, I'm Andrew Bunnell, and I'm a research student at Hope College. And for part of my research project on periodic transmission lines, I need to take a measurement using a vector network analyzer. This is an HP 8719C analog vector network analyzer. And although it's a little old, it still takes really good data. And for part of this, I'll be using a little computer program that I wrote to take the data a little quicker. Uh, so I don't have to write everything down and then type it in once again. But to take a really good measurement, I need to do a calibration. To start this calibration, uh, you hit the Cal key. And I'm going to be using a 3.5 millimeter calibration kit. And I can see that it's already set up for the 3.5 millimeter kit. So I hit the third soft button down, calibration menu. And I'm going to do two port full, which is the second from the bottom. Now, I start out with reflection. Uh, the first thing it asks for is S11 open. And so once you have the open um, adapter on, you push the open. Next, while I have the open piece out, I'm just going to go ahead and put it on to port 2. S22 open. The next thing it asks for is the through, is the short. So I'm taking the short adapter which reflects, reflects the RF back into the machine. And while I have the short out, I'm going to connect it to port 2. Next, I need to do a load. Connecting to port 1 first. Now once you hit load, it changes. This is a broadband load. And then push the button done loads. You have to do the same thing for port 2. So I push S22 loads, and now I press broadband, and done loads. Now the reflection portion is done, so I push the bottom soft key, and it says computing calibration coefficients, which takes just a second. Now the next thing I have to do is a transmission measurement. And to do the transmission measurement, I connect a small short SMA through bullet. And I do both forward and reverse. Now I press isolation and I press the omit isolation button. And that is how you calibrate the 
HP 8719C Vector Network Analyzer. Now I have my, now I have another strip already in a harness, ready to go. I have an extra block of Teflon on top and some clamps to help hold it down to help ground the back of the circuit board. Now I'm going to press the measure key and I'm just going to take a quick look at S21 in the forward direction and it looks pretty good. So I'm going to go back to S11 and start my program. This is going to take a few minutes so I just wanted to show you how to do a calibration on this uh, vector Network Analyzer. Thanks for watching.